Hello everyone and welcome back to number one PCO training. So in today's video, we'll be covering this route here, which is from Piccadilly here to, to Moorgate, yeah? So we need to find the most direct route. It does seem quite long, yes? But like I always say, we're going to do our uh, planning, yes? So first step, second step, and then third step. That way, we're going to simplify the whole thing, yeah? So let me take this line off. Actually, before I take the line off, I need my first step of planning. So, so from my green, I want to get to... Here, this is where I want to get to first. So Charing Cross, yeah, right here. Once I get there, I can focus on my second one, yeah? So from here to here, that's what I need to do. That's all I'm focused on, yeah? I'm going to forget all about my red point, yeah? So let me take this line off and zoom in. So I can see Charing Cross and I can see my start point, yeah? So that's all I'm focused on now. So I have no choice but to go up from here. I need to find a way to come into Piccadilly. So I'm going to take a, a left here. I can come down here. You see here, most people don't see this road here because all they do is follow this one-way road. You do not follow one-way roads, okay? if you have an option so for example now i have an option to take a left turn here i do not have to just follow the one-way road back to where i just came from so as you can see my left side there's no lines or nothing i can take this road and come straight down to piccadilly road yes so i'm going to take a left here remember i need to get to charing cross yeah so that's all i'm focused on right now and i can see it clearly it's right there so I'm gonna stay on my left. Then I'm gonna come down here, St. James's Street. And then I can take a left here. I can go around here. So now that I'm at Charing Cross, I can do my second step. So as you can see from here, it should be straightforward. Our end point is right there. So obviously I'm gonna use the strand here and then I'll eventually find a way to get to my end point, yeah? So I'm gonna go up this road here, follow this road round this one way and then stay on my left. Remember, do not touch these barriers, okay? That's how you lose marks, okay? Just stay in your lane. And then I can take a left here. So we're getting closer to the end point, yeah, which is right here. Yeah, we're getting a lot closer. So this is where you need to try and get the most marks by finding the most direct route, okay? So the basic route is coming here, going up, taking a right, going up again, and then eventually coming here somehow, yeah? Somehow come there, yeah? That's not what we want to do, yeah? Everybody can see that. What we need to do is find the most direct route, yes? So, as you can see, this road in front of me here, this Fleet Street here, is open and it's not closed. So, and there's no barriers. So, I can go straight down here. There's no barriers on this road too. So, I can go straight across. So this is the most direct route. This is what 
the um, these uh, this the test is asking you to do find the most direct routes, not the routes everybody can see. Yes, so I go up here, stay on my left, and then go to the top road, stay on my left again. Once I get here, so I can go up this one way here, then this one here, stay on my left now and go up this road and there is our end point so this is what the route should look like so this is the most direct route there you go so remember you have to find the most direct route so you don't always have to use what everyone can see we can all see these orange roads here you have to find another way to get the extra marks you need yes so don't forget to like and subscribe thank you for watching